we went for dinner first. After dinner, I told her, can you spare an hour for me, an extra one hour for me? Uh, so she's like, okay. I took her to a favorite restaurant, GDV. And over there, we were just chilling and we both had decided that this is going to be like a final meeting in which we have to kind of uh, decide what we really want. We were chilling and then I just whispered in her ears, will you marry me? And that was the moment and then I told him a yes. It was the best, like, that was the moment, I think. always knew each other since a very long time. We had actually met before in December, but uh, that time we both weren't sure where we were going to head. We both didn't talk, but we had seen numbers. Like, always I've heard couples saying, like, you know, you all just click. I was like, how can I decide? that I have to marry this guy in one, two, three, four meetings. Like, it's so tough. We had met a couple of times also in that period. We had met around five to six times. No one knows about this. It's unofficial, official. We met a couple of times. Then, I believe it was Sometime in June, when I realized that she's yet stuck in my head. But I always knew that he's the one because, uh, you know, you, I, I just got those vibes from him that, yeah, he's my life partner and he's the one who can take care of me all throughout. It's burning low Only miss the sun when it starts to snore Only know you love her when you let her go Only know you've been high when you're feeling low Only hate the road when you're missing home Only know you love her when you let her go And you let her go well, you only need the light when it's burning low Only miss the sun when it starts to snow Only know you love her when you let her go Only know you've been high when you're feeling low Only hate the road when you're missing her Only know you love her when you let her go And you let it go I would like to congratulate Neeraj on his impeccable taste in choosing such a beautiful bride. And Ayushi for putting her faith in Neeraj, because let's face it, where are you Ayushi? It must have been hard, sorry. I was told to roast Neeraj, and the roast couldn't include any profanities, no stories about women, alcohol, and most of all, and get this, no onion, no garlic, and no batata. But nonetheless, congratulations, Pillu. If you guys didn't know, his mom calls him Pillu. At least you got married before you went completely bald, bro. But here they are, about to be married, for better or for worse. Neera certainly couldn't do any better, and Ayushi couldn't do any worse. Also, Neeraj is by far one of the stingiest guys I've ever met. So Ayushi, I hope, I sincerely hope you have some tricks up your sleeve, yeah? The thoughts may be different, but the sentiments will certainly be the same. On that note, congratulations you two. We wish you the very best, and life and marriage has to offer, and you continue your journey.
just like a picture on the wall And now I know how to steer I'm not afraid if I should fall, yeah It took some tears, oh, but together we were strong And now I feel a burning beat inside my heart And I feel alive for the first time in my life